that's not working, so we're gonna have to try something else. <laughs> hey, I'm Emily Gokita, and I am a fitness trainer at Adidas and a member of Rose City Track Club based in Portland, Oregon. Adidas gave us the Ultra Boost lights with one goal to get them super dirty. Today, we're gonna go over how to get your dirty running shoes clean again. Going to wanna get all of your supplies in one place. You're gonna need a couple of different brushes. You're gonna want a softer bristle brush and then also something harder, a little bit rougher to get some of the dirt off of the bottom of the shoe. You could also be using things like old toothbrushes or other brushes you have on hand, but then something like a dirt pick will be super handy to get the dirt out of the bottom of the shoe. For the cleaning solution, you're gonna need washing soda, hydrogen peroxide, and some laundry detergent. The first thing you're gonna wanna do is brush the dirt off of the upper of the shoe. So you're gonna take your shoe and move it over either a towel or over the sink because this can get pretty messy. And you'll use a softer bristle brush and gently start to brush the dirt off of the prime knit fabric up top. It's much better to use a softer brush just to be a little gentler on this upper. Now I'm gonna to switch to this firmer bristle brush to get the midsole and the outer sole of the shoe. So same thing, you're just gonna to start to brush the dirt off of this part of the shoe. And then moving to the outer sole, bottom of the shoe, you're gonna do the same thing. This firmer bristle brush just really gets in there. And once you get a good amount of the dirt off, that's what this pick is for. And you can really get into the grooves of the shoe, get out those bits of rock. Wow, this is so satisfying. And then you can just go back in with the brush and just really get everything off before our soaking step. All right, now it's time for chemistry class. We are gonna mix up our cleaning solution. I'm gonna start with the half cup of water into the bowl. We are also going to add a half cup of hydrogen peroxide into the same bowl. Then I'm going to add the two tablespoons of our laundry detergent. And then finally, this half cup of the washing soda and it's already starting to bubble, so I'm just gonna mix this up. Hydrogen peroxide and the washing soda work together to kind of stain lift and help the shoes get clean. All right, now we're gonna take our firmer bristle brush and dump it into the solution here and go to town on the bottom of the shoe, the outside edge. And we're starting with the bottom of the shoe because when we're holding the shoe upside down like this and scrubbing the dirt off, you can see a lot of the dirt is just dripping down into the sink and also onto the upper of the shoe. So we're gonna tackle the upper second. And you can rinse your shoe in between. You can wipe it also with a wet cloth just to get some of the dirt off in between. So you're not just scrubbing dirt around. And this is already looking so much cleaner. It's just white, bright midsole, just with that little bit of scrubbing. Now we're gonna tackle the upper of the shoe. So the first thing you wanna do is remove the laces. And we're just gonna set the laces aside for a moment. And then I'm gonna take my softer bristle brush now that we're back on the prime knit and get some of this solution on there. And then same thing over a sink or a bucket or a towel. You're gonna scrub the shoe in circular motions. So you want a really nice clean brush and this is also why we washed the midsole and outer sole first because we really wanted to get as much dirt off the shoe as possible. Those are usually the dirtiest spots. And then just get underneath everywhere where the dirt is hiding. Pay extra attention to the toe box area here. This is where a lot of the dirt in the mud gets kicked up. And these are looking great. All right, now I'm gonna tackle the laces. So you can soak them in the solution ahead of time. You can do the same process as the upper, just start to scrub them. And you wanna get both sides. So I'm gonna go all the way down on this lace, 
on one side, just making sure I'm getting a good amount of a cleaning solution on there. I'm using the soft bristle brush again, just because the laces are a woven fabric. Do not be afraid to make a mess here, all in the spirit of having nice, fresh Ultra Boost lights. If your shoes are not super dirty and they're looking really good at this stage, you can just rinse them off and let them dry. But we're gonna go into a soaking step now. Now I'm gonna soak these shoes. We're gonna mix it up, same proportions, but just more water. Okay, and I'm just gonna use my hand and just mix this up a little bit. We are going to put our laces and our shoes right into the sink to let them soak. You're gonna let them soak for a couple hours, but if your shoes are super dirty, you can even let this happen overnight. You want the uppers of the shoes to be as submerged as possible so you can get creative and maybe put like a pot lid over or put some rocks in your shoes, whatever helps the shoes stay. These shoes have been soaking for about an hour. I'm gonna pull them out of the water and give them just a quick little rinse because there is still some of that laundry detergent in this solution, so we just wanna get some of the soap off. And then we are gonna leave the shoes here to dry for about 24 hours. It might take a little bit longer, especially if it's a colder day. What we are not going to do is we are not gonna put these in the dryer and we are not gonna put them in direct sunlight because the intense heat and the light can cause them to melt or curl. Which brings me to the most commonly asked question, can I put my shoes in the washing machine? And listen, yes you can. When you wash them in the washing machine, just make sure you're putting them in a garment bag and you're washing them on cold and a gentle cycle. And then let them air dry the same way, so no dryer. And I know that this isn't the most glamorous task, but it is the best way to make sure that your shoes last longer. So happy cleaning and even better, happy running.